Hey, good morning guys. It's Alex with Mages Library. Thanks for taking time out of your day to be with me. Uh, just want to give you some insight into what it is to be an eBay seller, a TCG seller of Magic the Gathering cards. That's what we're going to talk about on this channel. That's what I'm going to share with you. I want you to have the opportunity to see my journey, uh, the experience, the, the stresses of running this business and being involved in it and trying to make it work. Uh, I've been at this for years as a side project. This is all I'm doing right now. This is my my primary source of income. It's it's all I do from dusk till dawn. I wake up in the morning, I break out some orders, I process inventory, I come in, I pull the orders, I get them packed, I go to the post office. And what I want you to have from watching my videos is the opportunities to have the insight and to see what it is firsthand to, to watch what I'm doing, to see what other people are doing, uh, and to have a different perspective on this. Uh, I started this as a side project to help with expenses when I was going to college, um, and, and I ended up working jobs that I hated or jobs that I had a passion for in a career field that I thought I was gonna pursue and it didn't work out. Um, so everything that I learned from school, I've, I've I've applied it to this and I want to share with you again the struggles the the fears that I have the stresses that I have um, last night I made the decision uh, to upgrade my eBay store to the anchor store I want to share some of that details those details with you uh, the anchor store you get 10,000 free listings for $350 so you make 10,000 listings and you don't sell anything it was a bad month you spelled everything wrong, nobody could find it in the search bar, you owe eBay $350. And actually, if you read the detailed uh, contract that you sign up for, it's closer to an apartment contract. Um, it's, uh, I, I, I forget what the word is, but whatever day that you sign up, however many days are left, they, they do the fractional, what you owe them, blah, 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 and you owe the last month too. So I signed up for it on the 4th, because that's when I received my invoice for the prior month. So there's 31 days, 27 days of $350. You guys can do the math. I don't wanna to try to do it and embarrass myself because I don't have paper to work it out. So I owe $350 and probably about another 300. So roughly I owe them $650 next month if I don't sell anything. I hate making listings. It is the most tedious part of the job that I, I hate. I struggle with it. I need to make another 8,000 listings to, to feel like I got my $350 for worth. So that's what I'm doing today while I'm getting my reimbursement invoice for TCG player that needs to go to the New York warehouse out. That's got to go out 24 hours. Can't mess around with that. I have other orders for my eBay store and TCG that I got to pack. And, and this is it guys. This is, this is what 550,000 listed inventory looks like. I got it on TCG Player and eBay, and this isn't it. There's stuff behind you that I gotta organize. I got stuff in my room I gotta get organized. I got a warehouse or a storage unit that I warehouse my extra inventory in, and, and this is it. And I'm looking at a collection in the Bay Area that I wanna go pick up. It's 300,000 cards. Wanna add that? Where am I gonna put them? How am I gonna pay for my eBay bills? Where, where do I build more shelves? I have a finite amount of space here. And I just want you to know if you're home and you're thinking, I wanna take the chance, I wanna do this. You're by the water cooler, drinking your coffee. And you think that you can do it. It is the most stressful and terrifying thing that I've ever done. And I've done stressful and terrifying things for minimum wage and I woke up thinking how am I gonna pay my tax bill how am I gonna get eBay covered how am I gonna afford to get this stuff in the mail and am I gonna get to have anything to eat for dinner other than top ramen and a can of vegetables and I thought maybe I should just have a job maybe I should be those people you hear in the background going to a job again so if you got something and you're just griping about it, 
You can do this on the side, start it out, test the waters, but I just want you to know, if you're going to something that you hate today and you're miserable and you're for some reason you have it in your head that you're gonna just come in and destroy it, you're gonna be the best MTG seller ever. Here I am, years into this, just bought the bigger store, and I'm terrified. I have no idea how I'm gonna make it work. And even my worst job, I'm having one of those moments where I'm thinking about it. I wish I had that, because I know the money's coming in. So, just food for thought. I wanna leave you on that note. If you're miserable, I get it. On the flip side, this is terrifying, and I'm the only person I can depend on to make it happen. So, you guys enjoy your time. Thanks for coming by. I'll see you soon.